Have you heard of Kala Azar before or visceral leishmaniasis? These are names of a neglected but potentially fatal disease. 30% cases of Kala Azar in the world occur in India. Kala Azar spreads through the bite of an infected Balu Makhi or sandfly. It attacks the immune system and is almost always fatal if left untreated. 80% of India's Kala Azar cases are reported in Bihar. That's why MSF started a treatment program in Bihar in 2007. Over the next eight years, we treated more than 12,000 patients. But Kala Azar cannot be eliminated from India without addressing its co-infection with HIV. A person is said to be co-infected when they have two infections at the same time. So a person co-infected with Kala Azar and HIV has to survive not one, but two deadly infections. People living with HIV are particularly vulnerable to Kala Azar, while Kala Azar accelerates the progression of HIV. Considering co-infection carries a greater risk of death and is much more complex to treat, in 2015, MSF started treating Kala Azar HIV co-infection. We provide specialized treatment for co-infected patients at the MSF ward in RMRI in Patna. The team also advocates for testing and referrals in the state so that patients can receive the treatment and cure they urgently need.